Guess where I am? Don't tell me. You're at the thrift store again? Of course I am. It's so fun. I found such cool stuff and some creepy things. Of course you have. What horrifying t-shirt did you find now? Or let me guess. It's some old painting of a clown. Think again. Look at all the creepy dolls. I hit the jackpot. Are you kidding me? That is so scary. No, thank you. Pack it up and go home. Hi, everyone. My name is Gabriella, and welcome to a scary chat story. Let's jump right back in and see what cursed object she found because there's no way this doll isn't about to be haunted. You're not seriously going to buy any of those, are you? <laughs> That's for me to know and you to find out. Don't waste your money on that. Oh, come on. You can't seriously tell me that this isn't the cutest little face ever. Cutest little face? No way! She promised she only wants to haunt your dreams forever! You're creeping me out, Al. That's the whole point. Please tell me you're not actually buying that. Man, you're gullible. Of course I'm not. I'm not out of my mind. All right. Well, let me know if you find any cute jeans or anything. But no more creepy dolls. What size Levi were you looking for? I found a bunch. Oh, great. Send pigs. Wait, hang on. What's wrong? Ah, what's going on? I just looked at the aisle over and... Look! Oh my god! It's not the doll! The one I sent you earlier! No way! It's following her around the store! Did she follow you? That's impossible. Haunted dolls only exist in movies, right? No, because we have done so many stories with creepy dolls. So if you want to check that out, click the playlist right up there once you're done with this video because these dolls get up to the scariest thing. Right, maybe someone just picked her up and moved her to the aisle right next to me? And how did I not see them? I don't know! I'm just trying to come up with a reasonable explanation! You're right, sorry. It's probably just a really bad prank by some employee who saw me looking at the doll earlier. It's just a prank! <laughs> Hopefully, maybe? Exactly. Now, get me some jeans. That's it! What happened? Alex? Is that the doll? Yes! I was browsing shoes, and I turned around, and she was just there! I screamed so loud, I scared everyone in the store. Alex? Alex, I think that's Alex. It's cool you're spelling. If it isn't. It's a cool way of spelling if it is Alex. If not, I have no way how you say this name. Al Alexi? Maybe? Uh, no, no. I think it's Alex. Just spelled really coolly. Okay, back to the story. I really don't think that this is a prank anymore. I think you upset the doll. OMG, stop. You're freaking me out. When I saw the doll, I threw it across the store. Her porcelain face shattered when I did. At least she's gone now. Gone now? This doll's been falling around and you just broke her face. Now you made her angry. I'm in the bathroom splashing some water on my face. It'll be okay. Okay, but I'm definitely shaken. Why don't you come over to my house? We can watch a movie and hang out. Sounds like a plan. I'm buying your jeans and I'm leaving. Good. Nope, 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 nope. Sorry, but you are not getting those jeans. What's going on? You're scaring me. I walked out of the bathroom and this was the first thing I saw. Why is it literally following her? You've got to be kidding me. I wish I was. This can't be a prank. The doll was completely shattered. You need to leave now. I am working on it. I made it to the car. I'm getting out of here. Noel, please come get me. Wait, what is happening? I thought she was in the car. Where are you? What happened? I was driving to your house when I thought I heard something laughing. I pulled over on Darkfoot Lane and then, ah, oh, I did. If you are new here, you have not seen the other stories where all this creepiness happens on Dark Cold Lane. So if you want to see those videos, click the playlist up there because everything is haunted about this street. I turned around and saw the doll in my back seat. What? Help me. She is following me. OMG. I took off into the woods, but when I looked back, she was chasing me. The doll. <laughs> Comment down below what you would do if you had a haunted doll chasing you because I literally would just lose my mind And how am I supposed to help you? I don't know. How do I get a haunted doll to leave me alone? I already tried breaking her. Hang on. How to get a haunted doll to go away? Well, I don't think you can make her go away. What? I think you have to find her a home. Well, she's not living with me. Wait, what about my aunt? 
She has an antique shop on Darkhold Lane. We went a few weeks ago. You're not far from her. This does not sound good. This does not sound good. Good idea. I just called her. She said she would take the doll. You're my hero. I'm heading there now. Later that evening. What's happening? Something bad is about to happen. Alex, I just wanted to give you an update on the doll. Thank you for bringing her to my shop. She wanted to give you a message. <laughs> no! I told you there is something amiss! Huh? She wanted me to thank you for finding her a new home. Her name is Penny. She was displaced when her last home burned down. And ever since, she has been looking for somewhere new to stay. <laughs> She's like, uh... <laughs> She's like, I did not need to know that. I did not need that message passed along to me. How do you know all that? Noel never told you? I have a gift. I can speak to lost souls. But that's besides the point. Penny will be safe here. Thank you for rescuing her, Alex. Uh, you're welcome, I guess. The next day. OMG, Alex! Did you hear? Hear what? My Aunt Jeannie's antique shop. It burned down last night. No, you've got to be kidding me! What? She's okay, but everything in her shop, it's ruined. The whole place seemed to randomly burst into flames. And don't freak out. What? Uh, everything burned in the shop except for the doll. Oh, of course. Literally, of course. I'm just glad no one was hurt. Um, also, don't try to pin this on me. You were the one who, who told me that your aunt would take the doll. <laughs> me too, Noel. Just please tell your aunt to get rid of that doll. Carson, where are you you missed the whole movie elijah omg thank goodness i have service now i have been trying to text you for hours i'm locked in the arcade what which arcade the one on dark Hole lane we went for my little brother's birthday party my mom wouldn't give me any tokens and i was so bored i must have fallen asleep okay well why don't you just leave? Grant and I have been waiting for you. Don't you think I would if I could? The doors are all locked. So call the owner. Or maybe the police? It's almost midnight. I was trying, but I didn't have any service until I got a text from you. So what are you going to do? I mean, I've just been playing games. <laughs> He's like, if we're being honest, I'm not that concerned. <laughs> They're all unlocked and are free when the doors close. Realistically, I could stay here all night. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let me get this straight. You get locked in the Dark Old Lane Arcade, which, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I could put a little pause, a little pin, a little pin in this right here. Dark Old Lane is cursed. We have done several stories where it has taken place on Dark Old Lane, and it is never good. So whatever fun he's having now is the, the other shoe is about to drop. It's about to get real haunted up in here or real quick. And now, all the games are free? I'm so jealous! Isn't it amazing? Sorry I'm missing your sleepover, but I can't miss an opportunity like this. I don't blame you, man. Whoa, okay. This is not fun anymore. Mm, told you. I told you. What happened? I was just playing Pac-Man when all of a sudden the game shut off. Did the power go out? Or maybe the game just glitched? That's the weird thing. All the other games are still on. When I went to reboot the machine, it was unplugged. What? 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 <laughs> How could you be playing it then? Maybe you stepped on the cord? Not a chance. I, Carson is typing. Hello? Carson? Carson? <gasps> Hello? Carson, I'm here. Where have you been? It's been hours. I lost signal again. Elijah, I do not think I am here alone. Someone for sure unplugged the machine, but that's not possible. Yes, it is. You were playing it. How? Like what? I've been hearing noises. I'm starting to get freaked out. What if there's just an employee there or someone else who got trapped? I don't think so. It's been hours and I haven't seen anyone. And I called out and no one answered me, but I can just tell I'm not alone. This is seriously weird. If there is no one else there, then who unplugged the game? I don't know. I just tried to plug it back in and the outlet started sparking. And now all the lights are out. See, not so much fun anymore. Not so much fun being trapped on Dark Old Lane. And I swear I hear someone whispering my name. I don't like this. You need to get out of there. Might I remind you? I am locked in. Besides, it's probably just my imagination. Famous last words. <laughs> sure, dot, 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 dot. I guess so. Sounds pretty haunted to me, though. Is the arcade on Dark Old Lane haunted? Yes. Dude! What? 
it! I may have Googled if the arcade was haunted, and I found something bad! What? It was Bill on top of an abandoned cemetery! That's not even possible! They couldn't have done that! Well, they did, when they built the arcade! I don't believe you, you're just messing with me, because you know that I'm freaked out! Come on, I wouldn't do that! Besides, it's not like I can be there unplugging your game and whispering in your ear! I'm home with Grant! See? Watch your help! What is happening? What is going on? All the games, they just turned on at the same time! They're all blaring music and flashing lights on and off! Have you called the police yet? I don't think the police can help me! I think, I think I know what I have to do! What? I don't know what you have to do! I'm scared! If you guys are enjoying this as much as I am, make sure you subscribe. I'm trying to hit 1 million subscribers, and you guys are doing such an amazing job of helping me reach that goal. So I appreciate every single one of you. And make sure you comment down below if you think Elijah's gonna get out of here or not, because I don't know what is happening. What? Or wait, no, it's not Elijah, it's Carson. Carson! I have to play their game. Whose game? What does that even mean? They want someone to play with. Who is they? The Lost Souls. They're lonely. I'm going to play with them. Okay to join them in their loneliness. You can't join them! They're ghosts! Carson, are you possessed? Elijah. Oh! <laughs> I didn't see that coming! Why are you trying to take our friend from us? We just want to play games. Who is this? Are you a ghost? <laughs> Ferdinand? Of course I'm a ghost. We're all ghosts here. And soon your little friend Carson will be joining us. You can't do this. I assure you, Elijah, I very much can. What can I do to get him back? Foolish boy, you cannot do anything. Once we decide we want a soul, there is no going back. What if, what if I told you I could give you another soul? <gasps> is he about to sacrifice himself for his friend? I'm listening. Take me instead. Take my soul and let Carson go. That is an interesting offer. The next time I go to the arcade, you have my permission to take my soul. <gasps> I'm about to tear up, not him sacrificing himself for his best friend. We have a deal. A soul for a soul, an even trade. Carson will be released shortly. And we'll see you soon, Elijah. Elijah, where am I? Carson, are you okay? I think so. The last thing I remember, I was locked in the arcade and the lights were going crazy. Then I woke up outside my house on the ground. But you're okay. You made it home. Yeah, I just don't know how. I wouldn't question it. Just go inside and get some rest. All right, would you want to come with me tomorrow? to figure out what's going on at the arcade? We can play some games and hang out. I'm sorry, Carson, but I don't think I can ever go back to the arcade. Oh, uh, that was a little tricky tricky because he said the next time I go back to the arcade, but if he never goes back to the arcade, he never has to give up his soul. Not if you ever want to see me again. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Never mind. Don't worry about it. I'm just glad you're okay. I don't know what is going on, but I'm glad I'm okay too. I'll see you tomorrow. I sure hope so. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was so good. If you enjoyed it as much as I did, check out the awesome videos I have for you on screen because you will love those just as much. And I'll see you guys later for the Scary Chat Story. Bye.